Forestry Commission has begun reclaiming forest reserves degraded by activities of illegal miners. Eight local firms will work on the project over 12 months in Ashanti, Eastern and Western regions. Chief Executive of the Forestry Commission, Kwejo Wusufri, says massive destruction by illegal mining operators has necessitated the move of him interior again. Apamprama Forest Reserve is one of the affected reserves in the Ashanti region, which attracted expatriates and local miners in 2016. At least eight Chinese illegal miners and their Ghanaian collaborators were arrested in two separate operations in the same year for plunging the reserve. The Forestry Commission also seized excavators and other mining equipment. Four Chinese illegal miners who were ordered by the Bekwai Circuit Court to reclaim degraded forest failed to do so after paying fines in 2015. Residents of Cobro, a farming community in the Amansia Central District, have suffered the effect of illegal mining. Many people have reportedly fallen in uncovered pits, sometimes resulting in loss of lives which weren't unreported. Nana in Tiamwa Amemkru the third is a Bekwai Akwemuhine. We have suffered the effect of illegal mining for far long. Many have been trapped inside the pits whilst on their way to their farms. Some illegal miners have suffered similar fates. The illegal mining has ceased for about a year now. Same cannot be said of uncovered pits. Some of them very deep and scary. I am aware. Some people have lost their lives in the pit, whilst others are also injured, but they go unreported. Court and other commission officials, together with Chairman of Parliamentary Select Committee on Natural Resources, have been touring the reclamation sites. Mr. Usu Efiye gives an overview. We selected companies that have what it takes to, to do it. Uh, it's not only here in Ashanti region. In Ashanti region, this is the first company. In Western region, we have about six companies that, that have been given the, uh, the permit to go and reclaim the lands for and on our behalf. This is only to let us know to, 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 to what extent the reclamation in is and whether or not we could allow more companies to do that. If you are in a crowd, you hear that people are talking about Garamsey, people are talking about the fact that I've given permission to some Chinese people to come here and do Garamsey on my behalf. But what you have seen here had nothing to do with Galamse whatsoever. It is all to do with reclamation of the land. Having done that, uh, by the time the rain season comes, we are now going to plant uh, some enrichment plants here to, to, to get the forest back. It may take some time, but we must begin from the beginning. From Cobro in the Amansia Central District of the Ashanti region for Joy News, I'm Interior reporting. You're watching John News Desk with me, Bernice Sabubedu. We'll take a quick breather now. When we come back, we'll bring you more stories, especially that one uh, on our John News agenda from the Upper West region, where police personnel there are resorting to one police officer, one standing fund policy, because there's too much heat in their office and they cannot work in such conditions. There's more on that right here on John News Desk. Do stay.